So you're sitting in class and your teacher says that if she sees one clip art on your PowerPoint presentation, she's going to go medieval on you. But she doesn't say anything about YouTube videos. So for this to work, your school or workplace must have a live internet connection and it must not block YouTube. If it does, then you're probably out of luck. Now because this doesn't work well on Apple computers, I'm going to go ahead and assume you have a Windows PC. Now unless you're in the Dharma Initiative and your computer's keyboard for some reason has a mysterious execute button, your start bar is probably going to be somewhere around here. So go ahead and click that and open up Microsoft PowerPoint. And we're going to start with a blank slide, no clip art because some people just don't like clip art. So you're going to go to View, Toolbars, and click on Control Toolbox. Now go down to the bottom right where it says More Controls. If you can't see it, feel free to hold up a magnifying glass up to the screen. But scroll down until you find Shockwave Flash Object. There you go, Shockwave Flash Object. Now draw a box. This is going to be how big your video is going to look on your slide. So you're going to see a big X. Now let's go to YouTube and let's find your video. And we'll pick one about clip art just for the fun of it. So scroll down and you'll find this share button. Click that thing. Take this URL and copy it. Now we've got to modify it before we put it into PowerPoint. So I'll put it here to make it bigger so you can see it. Now we're going to get rid of this watch question mark because we don't like it. And we're also going to get rid of the equal sign and make it a forward slash. And there you go. Now if you want the thing to start playing by itself on your presentation, all you got to do is hit or type and autoplay equals one. There you go. Now I'm going to make it smaller so you'll have even more trouble seeing it. So yeah, and this is your brand new URL. This is what you're going to put into PowerPoint. So copy this thing and go back to your PowerPoint presentation. Right click on this enormous X and go to properties. Now you'll see a movie field. Put your URL in the movie field, not movie data. It's got to be the movie field. Put it there. And then the embed movie box needs to be false. So you don't want it to be true. Make it false. Okay, I'll close this out. Now hit F5 to view your presentation. And lo and behold, here is your video with our clip art in our presentation. So if this is satisfactory to you. You can go ahead and save your abomination. And once you've done that, then you're pretty much good to go. That's all there is, that there's nothing else to do. So um, there you go. Very easy, stupid, simple.